In this tutorial, we learn how to create part using synchronous technology. Click on ISO part. Here we will create this part. At first we will be creating this rectangle of 72 by 145. Click on arrow near the rectangle and select rectangle by two points. This rectangle is horizontal, so we will create it at first on horizontal plane. Take your cursor to the XY plane and click on the lock. So that plane will be locked. Then create the rectangle from the origin point. Drag the point, click there. And from here you can zoom fit. Zoom minus by rotating scroll or roller towards monitor. Then give the dimension using smart dimension. Click on the line, give the location, give the length of 145. Enter and give the dimension to other line. It is of 72. 72. Enter. Then unlock the sketch. Then press escape to come out of the smart dimension. Then click inside the box and drag this arrow up and give the thickness. Now here thickness is 25. Give the 25. Enter. And from here you can view the isometric view. Then to hide this dimension, click here, arrow near the PMI. Click there, the dimensions will be hidden. Then next is to create this cut. Again click on rectangle, two point rectangle. Then lock the plane. Then create the rectangle. Then give the dimensions, smart dimension, give the width. Width is 24, location is 24 and length is 50. Give it 24. Then from this line to this line is also 24. And the length is 50. Click here, give the 50. Then one circle is required. Click on the circle and create one circle from the midpoint of the line and click on the endpoint of the line. Then remove the unwanted lines using trim. Click on trim and click on the object to be removed. Then unlock the sketch. Then escape. Then click inside the sketch. Then drag it below. So it will be cut automatically. And if it is not cutting in your case, from here you have to choose this automatic. Or you can also choose the remove or you keep the automatic so it will be automatically decide to add the material or remove the material go inside and click there so it will be cut to hide the dimension again click here so it will be hidden the next will be we will create this rectangle and extrude it the width is 36 again click on two point rectangle then lock the plane then select the first point Give the second point on the line. Take care that it clicks on the line properly. And give the smart dimension from this line to this line is 36. Then again unlock the dimension. Then escape to cancel the smart dimension. Click inside the box. Then drag this arrow. And the height is 90 minus 25. You can directly write it here 90 minus 25. Enter. So it will automatically work out that length. Then again click here to hide the dimension. Then next is this cut. There is this rectangle is there and one circle is there. Again click on two point rectangle. Then lock this plane. Then create one rectangle from here to here. Then give the smart dimension. Here it is 24 and 30. From top it is 24. This line to this line is 24. And from this line to this line is 30. Okay, then next will be this circle of 30 radius that is 60 diameter. 
then take the circle give the center point track this midpoint and place the circle then height of the center of the circle will be 42 plus this 6 that is 48 from the bottom click on smart dimension click on the circle and this horizontal line and click here and give the height of 48 enter and it is properly placed around the center and trim click on this trim and remove the unwanted object ok then click inside the shape drag this arrow inside give the thickness of 12 enter then from here hide the dimension here is the depth of 12 then next will be this cut of 24 diameter circle again take the circle command then lock this plane then create one circle give the smart dimension click on the circle give the diameter of 24 then click on the circle click on the bottom line and give the height of 48 and click on this vertical line and click on the circle and give the gap gap of half of the 72 that is 36 enter then unlock the plane then escape then click inside the circle drag the arrow inside and click there it will be cut then hide the dimension from here then next will be this cut of 72 by 6 up to 50 depth again click on two point rectangle rectangle by two points lock this plane click on this lock then give the first point give the second point smart dimension give the length of 72 and click on this line give the height of 6 then unlock the plane escape then click inside the rectangle click on inside arrow drag it and give the depth of 50 escape then hide the dimension click on this isometric view zoom fit that's all this object is ready thanks for watching we will stop here.